Welcome back, all signs, Aries, through Pisces, starting with elemental quickies. If it is not your story, acknowledge, move on, check back another day, and your other placements. Dealing with another Aries, Leo, or Sag, King of Pentacles, Five of Cups, and the Four. How to do that backwards. This person's not giving. I they they don't have anything to give. This is not. This is all one sided. <laughs> You know, I think they feel badly about it, but I don't think they're changing their stance on this not one damn bit. Mm -mm. All right. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, Roman numerals upside down. Screw me up. Tower, boom. All right. A change. Unexpected. Ooh, in the moon. Really unexpected. This was like blindsided bullshit. Can be Pisces as well. And then, ooh. One more. Whoever this person is just really dropped it. I'm thinking movement as in left. I don't see communication necessarily at all. I feel this is like major blindsided you wanting to talk to them and them just not even picking up. Holy crap. All right. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the sun. That is movement. That is happiness. What else? Oh, hello. This person wants to take you out. Well, we like that crap. I want to take you on a date. I want to get to know you, and they want to do more than just that. So this person's got really nice, sweet intentions here. This is somebody that you could feel a nice connection with. I like this a lot. Gemini and possibly Leo. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The hair font reversed. Why? Which is a five, which is conflict as well. Queen of Swords. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Very potent person, male or female. Oh, shit. Okay. Sorry, third party. Big time. Somebody got snapped. Busted. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. This needs to be rethought in a big way. Really? You can't get it? Look at them. Look at them competition when you have the queen of swords and the the pentacles this one's got the money to fight for what the hell they want and this one's got the intellect <laughs> and the connivingness neither one look real happy but i'll tell you what that's like somebody getting in the middle of a connection yuck all right clean deck aries person most on aries mind in their energetic field. Stop there. Okay. There's that Queen of Swords. Ooh, and Knight of Pentacles. One more for this person. The Empress. Okay. Let's have your energy too. Temperance. Okay. So this was an intimate relationship, somebody that you trusted very deeply. I mean, how they're feeling right now, they feel like they're telling the truth, but they're moving very slow. So this is somebody that is interested in you, but slow and methodical. How you're feeling about it, oh, you're wanting, you're holding back in a very nice way. It's like, I want to take my time. I want this to be correct, and you want them to be the long-term type person. This is really nice energy. Really nice energy. This is like the person of your dreams. <laughs> Here we have, both of you are a little unsure where this is going, but it's got a really good base on it. I mean, wow. Anything else besides the moon for movement forward? I think they're just going to... Both of you are taking your time. I'm really nice. Energy. Nice. We like this shit. This is somebody that starts new. Can be somebody that you meet at work. But it's showing the balance between two people. This is somebody that you would be very comfortable with. Could be an Aquarius. Can be a Libra or a Taurus. Pisces lot of back and forth messaging but it starts small so i'm feeling kind of like the you know 
butterflies in the bummy type feeling when you meet this person. Nice. So this is like, I, I'm going to have this. I want this. This is good. This feels good to me. This is clear breakthrough. I like this. We're leaving this shit alone. This person's going to be somebody that is well off or extremely stable and looking for the long term. I'm feeling one hell of a nice balance between you and this person. That's the cuddle bug type person. Very nice. They think the world of you. They're digging you heavy and hot. Definitely wanting, you know, this is the kind of person. Can't have resting bitch face. The queen of swords gets what they want. They're very, you know, along with being methodical here with the knight of pentacles. They're also the type of person that is very strategic. So... <laughs> I'm not saying sneaky, I'm saying they're, they're, they are a planner, big time planner. So that looks like kind of some fun. Let's see what we get from the Shit Happens deck. Shit Happens. Then we'll get a yes, no. You have your silent fart is about to explode. Hold on. I think you'll be able to fart in front of this person and feel just fine about yourself. I really do. Okay, source, one from the universe. Aries will be revealed. I don't, this is new, very new energy. It feels pretty damn sweet to me. All right, I hope that resonates for somebody because boy, does that look nice. Okay, on we go. On we go to Taurus. Dealing with an Aries Leo Sag. Aries Leo Sag, Taurus. Queen of Pentacles. All right. What else? can be an age difference in the world. We need one more new or old chapter. Are we wrapping it up? No, we're starting up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This person has sexual interest. Can be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I'm feeling the need to say as well. Very reliable. Can be somebody that's well off, but fun. Fun. Fun, frolic, new. Like it. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Right. Justice. So heavy on the Libra. And then you got the King of Swords. Oof. Why the King of Swords reversed? This person wants things their way. They can be a little bit manipulating. They think it's fair, however, wanting to this is a bossy person, but they do want to move things forward. That or they're bailing. I want one more. It's like, I feel that this is the right way, the fair way. No, this is new, a beginning. Ace of Pentacles, it's like, I have something. This is going to happen. I want this to happen. This person's very damn determined. <laughs> With the King of Swords reversed, they can be a little bit pushy, <laughs> but and, and not the most, like, uchi gucci smothery, lovey, but very, very determined. Nice. Also can be a Cancer. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. People are coming out of the woodwork here. Here's a, I'll be damned if I'm giving you any fucking attention. <laughs> because I'm really pissed off. So, <laughs> this person feels that they possibly were judged incorrectly about flirting or, you know... <laughs> talking to somebody they like no that's not how this shit went down why are you so ticked off okay taurus virgo capricorn wheel of fortune things moving forward as they should be and in the direct timing that they should be now why do we have the four of wands reversed okay there's a little bit of disappointment in a connection doesn't mean it's the end of it, but we also have the Six of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So this is telling me that this isn't like it doesn't have to be the ending, but there are problems and things will get better. They should clear up, but you have to try not to feel so negative. And so does that damn person. Can be an Aquarius. It's like, don't feel hopeless. Not all is lost. Okay. Clean deck. Move that one out of the way. And, oh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Here we go. Tauruses. Person most on their mind, please, source. All right. Empress reversed. 
couple more. Nine of Wands and the Emperor. All right, let's get a little energy for you. Taurus's energy, please. Hey, Priestess. Nine of Cuppies. One more. Justice. Okay. So this person that you're dealing with feels like they kind of, they're emotionally exhausted. They, they feel like you're in charge of everything and therefore they feel kind of like you're being pejorative, you know, belittling them. They could feel a little bit smothered. Yeah, I'm really feeling that they're just a little bit overwhelmed with how potent you are. They feel like you're the one that's in charge, you do everything, and that they have no say. Down here we have possible Libra, but, and a Pisces. This is, you know, you're content, you're good with how things are, you feel that they're fair, you feel that this is the right person for you. So what's the snag here? What's the damn problem? Okay, Ten of Cups. What's the imbalance here? There needs to be a little bit more communication about who does what. King of Pentacles. Yeah, you know, I'm just going to say it like I see it. You need to give them a little bit more of head of household importance. They're, they're feeling kind of like a peon, like a pussy whipped wimp. Let them have a little bit more say about what happens because right now I'm emotionally exhausted. I don't feel like this is that damn terrible. Potential outcome. Potential outcome. Seven of Wands. Okay. Yeah, they need to, but they do. They need to stick up for themselves a little bit more instead of remaining so damn quiet about it. This is two people that, that it's an intimate relationship. It looks like it should go just fine, but they are a little bit irritated. So know that. Irritated. It's like, give me, they want more balance. You feel like things are balanced. I don't think they're telling you. I don't think you're aware of it. You feel like you're aware that, oh, everything's good. And, and then all of a sudden, boom, and you're like, what, what? They want to feel more important they, they don't want to feel like they are less. They want a very even connection. They don't want to feel like they're less. So we have potential of Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, Libra, Taurus. I don't think they're anywhere near just going, I give up. But I don't, or, you know, it's like, mm, they want you to let them express themselves a little bit more. All right, because this does look like a good connection. I don't see any major problems other than that. This is just a little bit of miscommunication. So Libra, and you seem content. So are you blind to it? Possible if they're being quiet. All right, let's get uh shit happens card. Taurus. Shit happens for Taurus. There we go. Wear a shit-eating grin and take action. Proceed. Very nice. And then one from the universe. Source. Any other input? Taurus. Like, fucking maybe. All right. That's what we have for you, Taurus. And on we go to Gemini's. Okay, gems. Source, what do we have for elemental quickies dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius? The devil can be Capricorn. What else? Okay, this is a breakup because of something toxic and shitty. There could have been another person that was, no. Nah. They might still come back around, but this feels like they were cheating straight up. I mean, really? Lovers reverse can be a Gemini or a Capricorn. So you'd have to decide if you'd forgive. But they were doing something behind your sneaky backy backy gnome. All right, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right. A little conflicty flicty. Uh, okay, this person is tired of this shit. And there it is. There it is. They want you to come back and clear this shit up because they feel burnt out. 
They are really burnt out. They feel like you always, look at that at the bottom of the deck. Come back to me. Come back to me and clear this up. This is called communicate with me because I'm, I'm tired of fighting. But this is also the you always have to be right. And not wanting you to act like you always have to be right. Just saying. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Page of Cups. Why the Page of Cups reversed? This person is heartbroken. Disappointed. One more. Uh, they don't want to have, you know, they don't want to have to argue about this. They would rather things just move forward smoothly. They're impatient. So I would say if you reached out, you might get somewhere because they got their bottom lip hanging out. They are heartbroken. If this is something newer, also can be a younger person, but it's like you got conflict. There's a bump in the road. Something could probably still be cleared up with that. Okay. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Virgo, Queen of Cups, Reverse. I got another moody bitch. Ooh, shit. So you got two pissed off women. That's what I'm feeling like. There's some lies and bullshit. This is almost like this. Let's get one more. One more. Oh. Okay, so you're in the middle of, if this resonates for you, this is basically you are in the middle of starting over and there's two people fighting over you. One's like, no, you give to me. No, you give to me. Which one's going to win? You know? <laughs> One of them's full of poopa dupa here. Okay, sorry, I had to pause quick. So this is beginning with one or the other, but both of them are not happy, okay? It's like this is not an open relationship, definitely not. This is like, boom, somebody needs to, you need to make a choice between these two people. Can be in Aries as well. The Queen of Wands gets her way with her sexual undertone, and this one understands you better, but neither one of them are happy, and they're going... <sighs> I want so, so um, one's pulling on one arm and one's pulling on the other interesting <laughs> Woo! Uh, give me the Gemini I get, get give me the Gemini mine 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 my nine person most on Gemini's mine are in their energetic field okay there's the stress and anxiety. Somebody's really up in their head. Okay, hair front reverse. This is, okay, this is really kind of tying into that last one here. It's like, I don't feel like you're picking me. I'm losing sleep over it. I feel kind of like you manipulated the circumstances. Sorry, roles can be reversed. Let's get your energy. There's that, there's that Queen of Wands. Okay, so this is saying, I have to leave. I, I can't take the stress of this shit anymore. I don't want to be bossed around. Holy shit, look at that. You cannot make this up. These two people, you have to make a choice. Again, the Queen of Cups. Very much moody in this circumstance. You have to leave one or the other. Now this can be you've already left one or one already left you and now you're hanging out with a different one and we got a major jealousy shit going on here. Give me more for the hair font reversed. This person still wants to work on this connection with you. Can be a Taurus. One for the magician reversed. It's like I don't... They feel like you're ignoring them on purpose that you're just kind of... Fucking up. That's what they're feeling. You are fucking up. They feel like you're fucking up and that you're confused. This is basically like, um, what are you doing, honey? One for the six of swords. Okay, and here's the battling. The, there it is. I mean, pulling your arms. One in one direction, one in another. You might not see this coming, but this is how this per It's almost like you start again and somebody else is going what the fuck are you doing i wanted you to come back and make an offer to me Ew. how does this work out potential outcome oh jesus lord so yes you have to make a choice it's it's not even 
It's not even funny. Okay, it's a little bit funny, only because it's cards. Hopefully this doesn't resonate to anybody. Someone is going to be disappointed and hurt and heartbroken, yes. But whoever was left, what was the reason, okay? Were they unreliable? Now you're the Queen of Pentacles. This is you bossing up and going, oh, you know what? <laughs> One more for this. It, whatever you choose, you are going to find your happiness. You really are. There needs to be a big change, and there's going to be a big change. This is transforming. This, is, this to me, feels like whatever the new person is, is the one that you are making the fast action with, and the other one, you're just closing off emotionally for whatever reason it was. You dropped it, and now this person from the past wants to talk. They don't want the ending. They want you to come back. Day late and a dollar short is what it's looking like to me because you're moving on. So it can be an Aries. Yeah, you're moving on. You're going to find somebody that's a better suit for you. It can be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But that's what I'm seeing here is, is you really being pulled in two different directions. And it's like, it, th this was already done. Now it's like, but I'll work with you. It's a little bit late. This is really feeling like it's a little bit late. You always acted like you had to be right to this person I am speaking. Um, I, I don't see that you want to go backwards. I see that you want to go forward. You just kind of dropped this burden here. It was too much, and you didn't feel like they shared the burdens with you. So, you, you know, you just closed off to that person. But holy crap. Heavy on the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And I'm saying that because of the earth sign here that was a match to the king. And also from the elemental quickies. So you got two people, male or female, doesn't matter. There is no gender, but I'm feeling that it could be two women, can be two men, can just be a man and a woman. It does not matter. This person, want, you know, you're leaving, you're, you're moving into something that's smoother, and they're like, what the fuck are you doing? So, you know, this is basically like somebody fighting over you, wanting to talk this out, and you're going, where the hell did this come from? I don't think you see this coming. Your action's moving forward, not backwards. Not backwards. You'll be clear, concise, and honest, and they think you are screwed up in the head. Moving forward, changing your reality, manifesting a new beginning. Are you ignoring them on purpose? Probably for a damn good reason. Maybe they manipulated the situation and that's why they're all stressed out. That can be guilt because of what the hell they did. And the, with this hair font here reversed, it could be that they screwed it up by stepping out. Just saying. Now, if you want your ex back, yeah, they'll work with you. But uh, whatever they had pulled, are they, they still want you to make this up. Why is it you that needs to go to them? I'll work with you. Well, then you fucking come to me and talk. Hmm. Heartbreak, you had as well. It's not, this is almost like selfish. Me, 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 me. I feel this way. Well, yeah, did you look at how I feel? Seriously. So this is you moving on to something, but you're going to be happy. This is not happening overnight. God, I hope not. Holy shit, that's a lot. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Water signs up here. Taurus, heavily. Pisces, Scorpio. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Look at that. You just can't make that shit up. Mm -mm. Two very jealous people. And one's a little more quiet about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One's going to try to, you know, use your emotions to make you bend their direction. I don't think you're going to have it. Um, and then Scorpio here again. And Virgo. Okay. Wow. Well, that was fucking exciting. Let's get a shit happens card. I was like, holy shit, Gemini. That was exciting. Today on Jerry Springer. Holy crap. Up shit creek without a pedal. Go with the flow. Assistance. What's at the bottom? Discover the meaning of shit. Quest. All right. Let's get one from the universe. Let's see if we got anything else. Source for our Geminis that, wow. Try to keep your arms attached. All the way, baby. Woo-hoo! You got a yes 100% as well. I really think you are going to find your true happiness. I really do. Uh, that's what we have, Geminis. That was exciting. Thanks. Because I really had fun with that. 
Okay, Cancer is dealing with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Alright, let's see what we got. This person is not happy that things aren't going well for them. They do want to have a connection. They aren't confused anymore. Isn't that a pity? So they got a little bit of karma. They're not happy about it, but they do want to try to reconcile or be with you. Hmm. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The sun can be a Leo as well. This is like an action card as well. Moving forward, wanting to make an offer. They got the, the it's like dibs on cancer. What else? One more. And it does look like this wouldn't be one-sided. So this looks like a good connection. This can be something new. And I'm saying that because the Ace of Cups. So that would be moving forward. Start with dating. Nice. All right. What do we have for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces? Defense mechanism. Internal defense mechanism. This person is not feeling good about something. One more. Could be that they're missing you. Yeah, it kind of feels like they miss you. Perhaps they didn't stick up for the connection when they should have. I don't know if you'll hear from that one yet. Kind of tough call, but they do miss you. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Mm, what goes up must come down. Spinning wheels got to come around. Okay, so this one's coming around again. Or they want you to come around again. They don't want to argue about things anymore. This is willing to compromise. Yep. So if you're in a separation, this person doesn't want to try to work this out. Okay. Clean deck. Source, Cancers, person most on their mind or in their energetic field. What do we have? That person's energy. Okay, you got the Nine of Pentacles. So single right now. Or extremely working on their cashola. This person's kind of stubborn. They expect people to come to them, but they are balanced. Eight of Swords, they do feel stuck, though. Hmm, let's get your energy first before we dive in. Page of Pentacles. Did your friends own them? What else for you? Okay. This feels to me like you didn't like the fast action that they did, okay? The in and out, the on and off, the connection just was on and off, on and off, on and off. You still have feelings for that person? Yes. Why does this person feel stuck? I'm almost getting the feeling that they just want to be single or they do not want to... No, those little fuckers. No, no, no. This person's not reliable. What did they do? What did they do? Oh. One more. And that's the Three of Cups. So I'm wondering if they were uh, schmoozing with another person. You have it on your side and they have it on their side. I don't like it. One more for them. How do they view you? Six of Pentacles reversed. They feel this is one-sided, that you did not give enough to the situation. What, you didn't put out enough, and so they went looking elsewhere? It can be a Taurus. This is also the card of higher learning, so everything was learned about, but it's done. Can this be reconciled, bottom of the deck? Yes, but are you going to tolerate that shit? That's contentment. All that's missing is one more cup. Underneath that, you have the Three of Pentacles. This is somebody that potentially wants to work with you, but, you know, they have to put more love into the situation. What's under that? <laughs> and not screw around, not look for attention other places. This could go in a positive way. It really could. They're watching you right now. So this is somebody that probably misses you, does want to be happy again, but, oh... They're being really stubborn. 
So you had an ending. This person feels, well, no, I'm, I'm saying you found out that they were in and out, on and off, flirting with other people, whether they stuck their dipstick in or spread their legs. We don't really have here, but this is one hell of a connection. And right now you're just like, I'm good with being friends right now until you get your shit together. I don't feel like you're completely ignoring them. They feel stuck. Well, they did it to themselves. Can there be commitment here again? Probably. Do you have feelings for this person? Yes. Do they have feelings for you? Yes. Did they put you in a third party situation? It sure the hell looks like it. And they don't, they're, they're not even defend, well, kind of defending themselves being like, you know what? We weren't together or we weren't this or whatever. It's almost like they're saying, but we weren't a couple at the time. Or we were on a hiatus from our relationship. Like they're trying to back it up. Right now, there needs to be one hell of a big change. This needs to be turned around to say, you know, that it's not one-sided of a person putting work into it. Mm -mm. This Knight of Wands, up and down energy, in and out. Even if they weren't screwing around, they weren't reliable. It was like on off. And this has a lot to do with it. I want my independence. I want my freedom. They have to figure it out. Like you can have your freedom. You can go out and, you know, drink and suck it up with your buddies and friends and hang out and celebrate and do whatever the hell you want and still be reliable and to, in, in a connection. So I would say, you know, as stuck as they feel, this still could move forward, but a lot would have to change. But it can. It sure can. It does look like they want to. So if stubborn, if you really care about that person, stubborn's not re reaching out anytime real soon. But you, know, you can if you want. I think they would. I don't think they'd ignore you. I think they care. One shit happens. What do we have? Don't give a shit and move on. Release. Really up to you. All right. One from the universe source for cancer. A little more for cancer. You're heading in the right direction. And what's at the bottom? All the way. This could go all the way. All right. That's what I have for you, cancers. And I'll be go to Leo. All right, Leos, Aries, Leo, Sag. If you are dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. All right. What do we have? The Fool. Heavy on the Aries. New. New. Or Foolish. Or Foolish and New. And Slow as Fuck. What else? the hell this person is moving away they're not coming your direction so they're damn lost screw that we don't wait for people we don't wait when no fire signs don't wait slow in reverse okay gemini libra aquarius one more shuffle gemini libra heavy on the libra justice Balance. What else? Four of Cups reversed. Interesting. I think you'll be hearing from this person. They're gaining interest back or they feel you're getting attention from somebody else and they ain't liking it. So I do feel that this is going to be a breakthrough. It's like, I want to win. <laughs> That's some potent shit. Okay. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Stubborn energy today, guys. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. The star, the Ace of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. Mmm. Okay, bottom of the deck, you got the Queen of Cups. So heavy on the water here, but you know, this is really also can be an Aquarius. This is really saying, hey, I want this. I'm going to make this work. But they're afraid of it being one-sided. So I think they're wondering if you are interested. All right, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Wow, you guys, stubborn energy. Holy crap. 
death. But um, boom. I don't know. The flower looks. The rose looks alive to me. He can be a Scorpio. Six of Swords. Transitioning, moving into clearer waters. What else? Four of Swords reverse. One more. This can be one hell of a change. Oh, but it's a manipulator. So this is like sweet talker. I get my way. They need to change. I don't see that. Mm -mm. I would be careful with that. It's like, you come my way? That's stubborn bullshit energy. We don't like that crap. Fuck no. All right. Source. Leo. Person most on their mind. A little energy for them. A little energy for them. But there's a sweet offer. This is like, I will have. Ooh. I will have a return. No, it's the dango. This person wants to reach out. I still see that they are confused or they're confused about what the hell to do, but they want to come in. Can be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'm thinking they feel competition. Let's get a little energy for you. Confused dingle. What do we have for Leo's energy source? The lovers. Gemini, potentially. What else? Queen of Wands. You don't want any competition. You're kind of pissed off. <laughs> That's saying you could be a little bit bossy about this connection as well. Why are they confused? Because they miss you. Well, isn't that something? Why the five of pentacles reversed? Because they want to come forward. This is like challenge central. I will have my word. Really, you think so? Can be a cancer. This is them really up in their head, wishing, hoping. Wanting a breakthrough. See the water here? That's a lot of emotion. Can be an Aquarius. What's underneath of that? You might stay single to this. Why do we have the Knight of Swords for this person? That's not like, you know, Mr. Suave coming in with the flowers. Ooh, they think you're just going to drop it. But why are they being so pushy pushy then? One more. Because they didn't want this ending, or they now changed their fucking mind. Hold them back. There's my Leo. How does Leo feel about this person? I think you're ticked off. You feel like it was one-sided. What's new? New for Leos. New, new, new. Empress reverse. You need to feel better about yourself. This is kind of like it, it took a dig on how you felt about your entire personality, how you looked, the whole shit. What a crud bud. Ugh. Fuck you, Dingleberry. I'm the bomb. I'm Leo. Mm -mm. Put your damn foot down. Don't let anybody treat you like that. Do not let anybody treat you like that. Look at this. You got wish fulfillment and communication coming in. I will be right. This is your energy. Okay? It's like, I am not. Ignore that jackass. I am not going to lose this. This is you standing your ground, getting your way. I'm liking this shit. It's like, I made, I made, no, this is my choice. My choice is no. Mm -mm. You're going to try to ignore them. They didn't learn a lesson. So too damn bad. All right. What is new, new, new? What could be coming towards Leo sign-wise? Okay, it can be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This would be newer dating. Somebody that's a little bit intrigued by you. Feels very new. Could go into something nice. Damn, Dingo. And very slow and methodical. So I do like that. Ooh, 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 ooh. This person would make you feel happy. I'm not going to say it'd be like the love of your life, but I do see you moving forward. Starts as friends. Mm-hmm. That other person, that jackass, that damn devil, cute or not, no way. This is, you know, they made you feel like a bag of worthless shit. That's like pejorative jackass. We don't like that at all. You have the upper hand here. 
you win just by making them know that you are this way. You are not a reversed empress. No. You are not codependent. You're not smothering. You're not jealous. Even if you are jealous, don't ever let them see you sweat. Ever, ever, ever. Mm -mm. Get your fulfillment. Get your abundance. Feel better about yourself. This person was emotionally immature and they, it was one-sided happy horse shit. As you feel here, it's like you didn't give to the situation the way I did. Why do you think I felt like shit? No. No regrets, Leos. No regrets. There can be a Gemini come in your direction. When you do meet somebody new, you are going to just feel this instant click and butterflies in your butt. Um, whoever wants to, you know, get back together with their ex, it's possible. It is. But they're still confused. They still, it's like you're just an option. Keep that in mind. They're still looking around. They do miss you. They do. They could be regretting whatever the hell they did. It could have been fast action, and it was a bad option. Whatever the hell they did, it was not a good thing to do. But this is, I will have my way. Where's we? Where's the emotion here? No. So you have Cancer, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Scorpio. You're going to have some attention. Could be, I see messaging back and forth. Some fun, you know. Get your mind off the dingleberry if that is not what you want. Okay, let's see what else we had up here. I'm interested about this one here. That's, you know, initiating conversation. And with the Eight of Wands, it's back and forth, fast movement. Can be somebody that is at a physical distance. But this is you needing one more cup to make yourself complete. You make yourself complete by loving yourself. I know it's so annoying to hear that shit, but it's true. Nobody should have to feel like the queen of wands. That's insecure. Insecure. I'm keeping this empress upright because you know your value and worth. You just got a, you know, a ping. No, no more pings for you. So we have heavy Scorpio, heavy Aries Leo Sag. But I, the new chapter of your life is for you to get. you got to go after that shit, and you're a fire sign. You can do this. You can do this. Let's get the shit happens deck. It's even brown like shit. Got to like that. Okay. One for Leos. What do they need to hear? Do more research, you crazy shit. Discipline. Gee. <laughs> One more. Shit is deceptive manipulation. See the sack of shit there? That's the dingle. See the flies? Yeah, dingle. Damn dingle. All right, one from the universe. One from the universe, please source. I know some of you are still in love with your dingle. I do. This is not for everybody. The universe is working on it, but that also means you have to work on it too. Be sure of what you want and go after it. Emotionally, mentally, the whole shit. All right, that's what I have for you, Leos. Oh, that was heavy. All right, on to Virgos. All right, Virgos, here we go. We are trying for absolutely positive energy. Aries, Leo, Sag, what do we have? Movement forward or waiting? Oh, ouch. This person's taking a little bit of a time out after a painful ending. It was a lot of burdens, so I don't see this person's ready to communicate. I think they're moving into a different direction. Okay. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay. Wanting to come in out of the cold, wanting to try to possibly reconcile, but feeling a little bit pessimistic about it. What else? Could be thinking that you don't want them back, but this could go very well. Can be a Leo. That is movement. It actually is movement. Okay. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. The devil can be a Capricorn. Obsessed or toxic? Obsessed. So this person wants to strategically have a conversation. 
Uh, one more. One more. I think they're leading you on. There could be more than one person here. They also could be using your emotional side to get their way, but I don't think the intent is very good. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Sorry, guys, I cannot pound sunshine up your ass if I don't see it. Here, I will pound it up your ass. We read what comes up. All right, Page of Pentacles reversed. Questionable on the maturity. Boom. Big change. Change of sorts. This person is, is holding on to you emotionally. One more. So that is somebody that is hurting. They do miss you. They probably wish they would have given a little bit more to the connection or situation. Okay. Clean deck. Source, our fine Virgos, what do we have for the person most on their mind or in their energetic field? A little bit of their energy. Okay. Two of Wands reversed. And the Nine of Pentacles. Let's get a little energy for you. And the energy for Virgo. All right. Okay, so the person over here, the person that's most in your energetic field is single. Right now, um, they're not making any choices, any decisions. Not do, They're really not doing anything besides work. One more for this person. Why are the two of rods reversed? Okay. They're not feeling like enough is being offered to them. Yours is showing that there was a disconnection on the home front, but you still have feelings for this person. One more for this Ten of Pentacles, King of Swords reversed. You feel like you were manipulated. There is a bit of a trust. Let's see what we have for mutual. What's the mutual? Doubt. Okay, so there's doubt in who gave more, who put more work into things. Where does this go? Not sure yet. I don't know that this is moving anytime soon. What is new, 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 new for Virgo? This is the feeling of deception. Okay. Hurt, pain, loss. This is showing that you are still hurting from this breakup. But there could be somebody new coming in. I mean, you still have passion for them, but this is a new venture, new creativity. But you got to put work into it. One more. It can be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The Empress. However, they're really going to dig you. What's that? Ooh. This is intimacy. This might be coming in faster than you think. Um. Make sure they put work into it. So this is somebody that really wants to get busy in the sheets real fast, but a lot of energetic. It's not saying just because it's a nine of wands doesn't mean that it's in and out. They want to get in real fast, but they view you as so handsome, so good looking. And this is intimacy. This is patience. This is Netflix and chill. It's having fun. It's enjoying. It's learning about each other. The only concern I have is this one here with the eight of coins being reversed they might be extreme no this moves forward really nicely this is something that would make you feel like you get a lot of attention from this person take your time slow and methodical mm -hmm. but it does look like it moves forward really nicely so we're gonna leave it there you know I really I wish I could make this wonderful spread I, I only can read what I see so the person from the past you still have emotions for and you feel like they manipulated you're not sure the moon is just not being sure and the fears are you afraid that this person and you are done it can be the dope between the two of you it's but it's two it's both ways it's both ways but there is somebody, after you do a little more healing, that has interest in getting busy, getting to know you, 
was similar to yesterday's. Can be a Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Libra, Taurus. A little heavy on the fire, but this per this this is someone that really is into you. It's fulfillment. It's being treated like a king or a queen. It's very nice energy. All signs are up here, including the Pisces that we have here. You still have feelings for that person that you were in disconnection from. All right, let's get one from the Shit Happens deck. Shit Happens. Get your shit together and organize. Let's see what's at the bottom. Kick some grass over that shit and move on. Ooh, that's one way to do it. All right, and one from the universe. Please source. A little input for Virgos. This one here. Yes. Yes and yes. All right, bottom of the deck. You have 100%. Yes. All right, Virgos, that's what I have for you. And on we go to Libra. Elemental quickies. Aries Leo Sag for Libra. Marcia. The Hermit Reverse and the Horse Asshole of Wands Reverse. This person's ignoring you. So if this is like a one-night stand type thing, they're ignoring you on purpose. Nope, not interested in sticking around. All right. How about Gemini Libra Aquarius? Gemini Libra Aquarius. Two pen... A mm, little bit of a trust issue this person has. They're kind of on the fence about this. Let's see what else. Yeah, they're a little defensive. I think they're just afraid, kind of wimpy there that, you know, trust issues, but not, not pertaining to you. Okay, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Five. All right. This person wants you to stroke their ego. No, don't do it. King of Cups. Oh, and they're going to use, you know, like charm to... No. I don't have to be right. I want to make everything work, but stroke my ego and I, and I think the world of you. Bullshit. Careful with that. You'll be kissing that person's ass often. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Right in the middle where it gives, too. Shit. Queen of Swords is pissed off. Why? Why? Oh. Can be a Capricorn. What else? Why is this person so ticked? Justice. They feel like there's an imbalance here. It could be feeling that there was something. One more. It can be a Libra. Ten of Pentacles. They're pissed about something financially. This might not have, have anything to do with you. They might have had a court hearing or something of the sort and they didn't get their way and they are ticked. They're like, the other person won and it shouldn't have happened that way, so not happy. But I don't think that has anything to do with you either. I really do not. Okay. Source, Libra, person most on their mind or in their energetic field, little energy for that person, stubborn energy, one more, shuffle, come on, come on, yeah. there we go, the Knights of Pentacles, Mr. Molasses, Mr. Ms. Molasses, slow and methodical, Slow like a sloth. What else? Page of Wands. Well, this person is interested in you, but they're really hesitating. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to come off as an immature douche, so I'm going to come at you slowly. Let's have your energy related to this. Your energy. Ignore the washer. Two of Wands and three of Pentacles. Ew, la la. How about some combined energy? Mutual, mutual. Ooh. This is almost like two people trying to get to know each other. This is kind of nice. I'm liking it. One more for the hermit. Can be a Virgo. The hermit goes with him, but they really... Oh, hold him back. You got two people kind of holding back, but it doesn't seem terrible. You're over here going, mm, I'm really thinking about this. Mm -hmm, looking kind of good. This, 
this person's interested in you and you're over here going, I'd work with that, can be a Leo. The mutual energy is really nice. It's two people trying to get to know each other, holding back a little bit, not wanting any bullshit. This also can be trying to compromise, but it doesn't necessarily mean we have anything old either. One more for the Page of Wands with their interest. I'm intrigued. Two Pentacles. You both have twos. You both are a little bit iffy here. Two hesitant people with good intention, really good intention. The star. This person's gonna, this is like, I dream about you. Oh, apple pie, I dig you so much. Nice. Moving forward. What do we have moving forward? T he he double cake. Like it. So this is two people that are really gonna be interested in each other. I'm not seeing the devil as something terrible here. This is more just, you know, I really, I get to know you. I really just can't get you off my mind. Nor can I get the sex off my mind. That's really where I'm going with it. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think this could be something really good. King of Cups moving forward. So this person doesn't act out on their emotions, but they definitely have them. So I think this really could grow. I really, really do. And you got the Hierophant. So it could end up being something, we're just going to say long term, learning about each other. This is really nice energy for a new connection. So if somebody asks you out, don't hold back. Go. Go! Don't, don't be doubtful. Okay, the Seven of Pentacles, don't sit there and go, well, maybe, you know, my hair is not perfect. Whatever, screw that shit. Go. Go and meet new people. This person looks like they'd be a winner, a keeper. Sexual interest. There can be an age difference, I will say that. But I don't think it's going to matter because this is so methodical. Very, very much into um, working into a connection, working on a connection, uh, the two of pentacles still kind of on the fence and they might feel a little bit the, either they feel you could be a little pushy or vice versa but I don't see it's going to matter because with some time nice, 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 nice compromising so there could be differences between the two of you but I don't see it's anything terrible I see you holding back a little bit on your emotions so that you don't get hurt but wanting to work with that collaboration instead of masturbation. This looks damn nice. This is sexual interest. This is your roaming eye checking out all the alternatives. I, it's nice energy. So you have Taurus, Aquarius, Virgo very heavily, and then Aries, Leo, Sag very heavily, Capricorn, and Leo. It's nice. We're leaving it. We're not touching that. It's sweet. And I think that person would be sweet. Okay. Shit happens. Let's have one. You have. Don't give a shit and move on. Release. Move forward. Yes. One more. One more. I just love these damn decks. They're so much fun. One turd shuts down the water park. Use caution. I'm not thinking you're going to need caution. I think you're going to have some fun. All right, one from the universe, please, source. There we go. Unknown. You haven't met this person yet. This is going to be new. Of course. I think it'll be fun. Okay, on we go to Scorpios. All right, clean deck. Elemental quickies first. Dealing with an Aries Leo Sag. Source. Ooh, you guys are moving smooth. All right. The seven of fuckery. Holding back, upright. Holding back, holding back. So this is a person that you could have had a connection with before, but that's once, it's a very tight union. This person has emotions for you, but they're holding back. Why? Why? I'm feeling judgment. There's problems on the home front, but it's nothing that things just have to change. Bottom of the deck. You have the fool. This is trying to be, this person, expansion. You need to expand. Boss it up a little bit. 
Yeah, I think this could be wish fulfillment. I really feel like the the judgment should have been here, like change, because I'm feeling change, like this person's going to stop being so frigid. Okay, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Five of, I will fight your ass till the day I damn die, and I will be right. And it's giving you a damn headache. Slow. Hmm. What do they want to fight about that's so shitty that they're all up in their head about? Mmm. Slow in reverse. I want one more for that. I will take the two that came out kind of half-assed. The world and the two of wands. This person's got to make a choice to change this shit or it's not going to go anywhere. So very much at a fork in the road with that one. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Seven of Wands reversed. Very defensive, lacking courage, kind of a wimp. They want to move this forward. They are paying attention to you. They see you as the bomb fucking diggity, but they're not sure that you want to compromise and settle down. What else? Page of Swords, really watching you from afar. This is somebody that doesn't think they have a snowball's chance and how like they're not good enough for you. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Knight of Swords, Reverse, is a jackass coming in your direction to bitch. Why? Eight of Cups. Because you left the situation or they feel like you abandoned the situation and now they are pissed. No intimacy for them. No, 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 looking for you. They do have feelings for you. This could go somewhere, but you got to turn this around a little bit. They can't just come in and rip you a new ass. If they want to turn that eight of cups around because it's like they feel like the emotions are lost and that you walked away from that, they got to turn that shit around. Temperance. That is intimate connection. That's two people that jive together. This seems to be two people that are having a bit of conflict and need to talk, but very much care about each other. All right. Clean deck. Scorpio, person most on your mind or in your energetic field. Alright. Three of Pentacles reversed. Hmm. One more. This is swords. They, they, they want to break through as far as working together. And the lovers reversed. Okay, so issues with the love life. They don't feel like you've been working on things. Let's get your energy. Okay. Well, you're a little defensive as well. What else? But you still care about them. One more. All right, <clears throat> so you see this person is always being right. You still care about them, but you, you know, you're just kind of up to your asshole with the crap. One more for their three of pentacles, and they're pissed off. Mutual energy, mutual, mutual, mutual. The world. Why the world? One more. Okay, so you got two people that are not seeing eye to eye here. Is this over or is it moving forward? There needs to be clarification. This could move forward. That's stability, but there needs to be a change. Why do they feel like you're not working with them? Okay, are you hanging out with other people? I feel like you're not taking on as much responsibility. And that you emotionally kind of walked out. How do you view this as far as... Why the arguments? Yeah, you're kind of shut down to them as well. Frustrated as fuck. Come on. Movement forward. Queen of Wands. One more. 
Well, they are thinking about you. I don't know that you're talking to this person right now. It looks like there's a time out in this connection with the hair font reverse can be a Taurus, but somebody just dropped this shit and it needs to be talked out. I do see this person coming your direction to talk things out. They still are attracted to you. They still have emotions for you. You have emotions for them. Disunion right now, but this can be fixed. I think they're watching the shit out of you. Pissed off or not, they still have hopes that this can go somewhere. So do you. So this can be a reconciliation. One or the other has to budge. I don't know if it's going to be that person. They want to talk, but look at the stubborn fucking energy. Ooh. Anything else, Source? This just says, like, stalemate. Needs to move forward. Somebody needs to apologize. Somebody needs to clear things up. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? It will resolve things. Yeah. So, manifestation. Moving forward. I think you're trying to make this happen and draw them in for an apology. Or just to get, you know, get the discussions under underway you still have feelings for this person if you don't want to reconcile with somebody there is a new potential coming your direction but it's going to be a while which also leads to more frustration you think this person always seems to be standing their ground and making you feel very defensive it's like i've had enough of this shit arguments mm -hmm. they're ticked okay so it's like, they're not ready to talk yet, but they're getting damn well close to it. They know there needs to be communication. They do still have feelings for you too, but there's a problem. They may need to make up their mind and make more clarification on what their idea of working together is. What is their idea of working together? Because they certainly want a breakthrough. They certainly have an idea of what they consider to be working together. So you have, all signs are up here. Somebody needs to bend like bamboo and breeze. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, heavy, Aries, heavy, but all signs are up here. Stagnant energy, stubborn, stubborn, stubborn. Okay, let's get the shit happens deck and see if we can get something for you, Scorpio. All right, and we have... Shit always looks better on the other side of the fence. Be unique. Bottom of the deck. A good shit will inspire you. Ideas. Yeah, I think somebody's got a budge here. Stubborn, stubborn. All right, source. Yes, no, maybe so. A breakthrough is coming. I agree with that ace of swords. A very clear, concise honest discussion needs to happen and I see that it is coming all right on we go Sagittarius the one of the fire Aries Leo or Sagittarius the world reversed this person doesn't have closure so they're not making any choices right now they're looking at the two paths that they have to take but they don't want to move forward they want to come back your direction they feel badly Full reverse. It's like, did they, mm, you know, I'm feeling like emotional immaturity and, and impulsive shit that caused an ending or a disruption and now they don't want things to be done. They don't feel like they have closure. There's still, there's still sexual interest here. I'm not going to call it love. All right. So Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Sun reverse. Pessimistic. Why? So this is not moving forward at the moment. Queen of Wands reversed. So they think you're bossy. And moving away. Yeah, they think that you are, you know, it's like you're going to make them wait. They feel like you are just moving into a different direction, period. You know, they could be thinking that you stepped out of the connection. They're hurting. But, I'm not sure what they did either. You don't get both sides. They still have emotions and do care about you, but it does look like you moved away from them. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. 
Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Death, Transformation, or an ending, Change. This person doesn't want to be single or felt that you were codependent. And I'm saying codependent. One more. They dropped it. Mm -hmm. They felt it was the right thing to do. All right, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The devil. Could be on the Capricorn. What else? Three of Cups. One more. Nah, third party situation. I feel like this person acted like it was a friend, but it wasn't. No, we ain't bond that shit. They might come back your direction and try and convince you otherwise. Alright. Clean deck. Source. What do we have for Sagittarius? Person most on their mind or in their energetic field. That person's energy, thoughts, feelings. Not talking, not moving, not doing squat. What else? Oh, with their arms crossed. So stubborn as fuck. What else? And hanging their head. This person's sad, sacking it. They're sitting at home, eating ice cream, playing the blues. What do we have for your energy? You feel justified in what the hell happened? You feel like things were done correctly? That you got your balance? This came out kind of sideways, so it was kind of like a little bit emotionally didn't give enough to the situation, so you're like, fuck this shit, I'm out. One more. Yeah, Empress. There was something about this person that just didn't make you feel... It made you feel inept, and you're like, no, this is not how things should be. Mutual energy, you got the Ten of Pentacles, one more from Mutual. This was a long-term connection, and it was a very deep one. One more for them, their intention. Page of Pentacles reversed. They're not, this is like slow and reverse. They're not coming in your direction anytime soon. They're thinking about it. They know that there needs to be communication if they want to make this work. Do they want to make this work? Possibly. I mean, this is being like, I'm not the one that has to be right all the time. Bottom of the deck. It does look like they might offer something. How will you view this? What do we got? Seven of Cups reversed. It's going to be a little bit confusing to you, but not terribly. And it is something that you're willing to put work into. So this could be, okay, and then you got the star. So both of you are thinking about each other. Mm -hmm. What needs to happen is you need to work together better to have this union, turn this around. Both parties have to work on this. This can be resolved, yes, absolutely. Talk, 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 screw, screw, screw. <laughs> That's what they want. They want to, they, it's like fucking make up. That's what they want to do. So I do see this person wanting to come your way and go, you know what? I want to make a wrong right. And that's what's needed for you. So that you don't feel empty. So that you do feel more loved. So that you feel more appreciated. It can be a Libra, Libra Taurus, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. They're still feeling sorry for themselves, though. They really are. They, are they, they need to, you know, spit it out. Right now, they're not doing nothing. Just nothing. Feeling sorry for themselves, taking the time out, and sitting at home and having crying in their beer. Aquarius, Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, very heavily. Let's get an answer. When the shit happens, let's see if we can get an oracle for you. Oracle for Sag, please, source. You can't pick up a turd by the clean end. Control. I do see control issues. Who's in control? Shit or get off the pot. Decisions. Yes, that person needs to shit or get off the pot. Stop feeling sorry for themselves and come and talk. All right. And one from the universe for Sagittarius. 
line from the universe. Adjustments are required. I couldn't agree more. I do think that this could go somewhere. If this resonates for you, I do see a potential reconciliation. I do, I do, I do. Capricorn dealing with an Aries Leo Sag. Okay. Brum, 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 bum, bum. I have an offer for you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That feels damn nice. This person's sexually interested in you. You got a little cougar action going on here. So it can be somebody younger, but they want to ask you out and they have other ideas as far as long term or in nice connection. Gemini Libra Aquarius. I'm stuck. Why are you stuck? Why are you stuck? Oh, they're all up in their head. They're all up in their head. Why? Why do they feel so stuck? Because they aren't getting their way emotionally. You're not talking to them. <laughs> There's another one sitting at home eating ice cream, Netflix, and chilling all by themselves, feeling sorry for themselves, thinking that they're stuck and they're not. They're trying to drop some of the anxiety, but it's like they didn't get things their way. Emotionally could have been manipulating. All right. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Ouch again. Okay, so if this person realized that the knives aren't really in their back and woke up and smelled the coffee, they'd realize that things could go so much better. But they're acting like they don't even see anything. Mm -mm. They're just turning their head to this connection. What a dipshit. Dumb. All right. Cup short of a full cover. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Boom. Boom. Chakalaka laka. A change. Unseen. Page of Swords. Too many people with their nose in the shit. Mm -mm. They want to apologize. They miss you. What else? Yeah, that does look like things go into a, a more pa Ooh, bottom of the deck. Give them a little time and space. I think they're going to reach out. Okay, I don't think that this this is a, you know, complete done. It needs to change, yes. But I think somebody had their nose in it and could have uh, filled their head with air. All right, clean deck. Source. Person most on Capricorn's mind or in their energetic field. That was quite the dance. Two of Wands. Should I stay or should I go now? They're deciding on a path, but they're frustrated as hell. All right, what is your energy? They aren't sure what the hell direction they want to go in. You're the hangman. You're taking a time out emotionally, too, and really trying to think about what is best for the, the, the entire situation, what's best for yourself. Taking care of your finances. Taking care of business. Taking care of business, mutual energy. You both feel burdened. You both, now, if you shared that burden, things might go better. And it does look like that's possible. You have a three of coin. That's collaborating. That's learning how to agree to disagree when need be. And sharing the burdens together. This could be worked on. Why the three of wands reversed for them? They're not sure if they want to just start over and say, fuck this shit. Or if they want to make a new offer. And you, you feel like they manipulated something, overused their power. Yeah. It's like, I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna work on not being manipulated and not allowing you to walk all over me. There's still one hell of a connection here. Can be a Gemini coming your direction. <clears throat> Star reversed. This person doesn't know, doesn't feel that you feel the same way. They're like, I, I don't think they feel the same way about me, so I'm probably just supposed to go. It's like there was this argument, and they, they really, mm, they're irritated. Frustrated and irritated. Moving forward. What's this person intent? Nothing. Just going to be a sloth. And they're going to let it, they're just going to drop it. It's going to be their fucking loss. 
they're you know they're keeping secrets on how they really feel okay they should be apologizing coming your direction something needs to change big time however what's coming your way mm -hmm. you still want a reconciliation there isn't any talks and that person still emotionally manipulating but there could be an aries leo sag coming your way one of you wants this reconciliation one does not out celebrating meet a new person I don't you know when the hangman comes up it's like I'm I'm, I'm really needing to wait I need to think I need to take a break so you if you felt manipulated or you felt that this person was trying to constantly overpower you you're like I'm just gonna work on never having that happen again bossing up taking care of what I need to. I got my shit going on financially, etc. But I see an Aries Leo Sag coming your direction. So if it's you that wants the reconciliation, I I don't see that this person's coming in your direction anytime soon. This is like slow in reverse and they're frustrated as fuck. But they're not they're not making any movement. They're turning their back. Let them turn their back then. Let them turn their back and feel sorry for themselves. Strength can be a Leo, can be an Aquarius, Pisces. Let's see what else is up here. Aries, stale, Aries, stale energy. Pisces again. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but also Gemini. All signs are up here. Very stale energy. Okay, so if you're in a timeout from somebody, it's going to continue to be that way unless they can get their shit together. One from the Oracle deck. What do we have? Let loose and keep farting around. Recreation. Go out and have some fun. I agree. All right. One from the universe. Source. Capricorn. Fucking maybe. All right. That's what we have Capricorn. And on we go to Aquarius. Aries, Leo, Sag for Aquarius. Fire signs. We have some stubborn energy, guys. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Stroke my ego while we're in this connection, and I'll be happy. Just saying. So that is some, I mean, that can move forward. It really can. I feel like they're kind of feeling inept. All right, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person does not feel like this is done. And they have, ooh, that's like bold move, buddy. One more. I don't think they're done with this. No, they got a lot of balls. Okay, so they wouldn't reconcile. Yep, mm-hmm. And screw your brains out. Yep, a lot of sexual tension there, and that person's going to get what they want. All right, what do we got? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Not moving, not coming forward, this person. This person. Okay, extremely frustrated, but they're trying to manifest you because they care about you. Yeah, frustrated my ass. They're doing that to themselves. All right, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Can't get you out of my head. Mm-hmm. Strength. What else? Can be a Leo. Leo, Leo, Leo. Oh! <laughs> or a Capricorn. Why the devil? Okay, this person's thinking about you. What? I still want to know why the devil is here. They're holding back, but they don't want to. Oh, anxious as fuck, too. What else? What else? What else? Someone owes you an apology. Someone owes you an apology. Somebody needs to put their big britches on. Big boy, big girl britches and stop being a candy ass. If they're that obsessed with you, they need to come and talk to you. You come to me. All right. In deck. In deck. Aquarius. Person most on Aquarius is mine or in their energetic field is not necessarily the nicest person to be around. This person's very stoic, honest, 
giving, likes things to be very, very fair. One more for that person's energy. Ooh, that's like a major stubborn person. I mean, they could be sticking up for the connection, but ugh. why the seven? Why the seven? That's really, really stubborn. I'm feeling stubborn, stubborn shit. And irritated. Okay, so if they, they want to talk, they want to come at this fast, or they're going to take their sweet ass time doing it, but they don't have anything nice to say right now. If you have nothing nice to say, say nothing at all. What is your energy? Oh, dreamy. Dreamy, steamy, who you got a crush on? Who you got a crush on? Nice. You are going to have one hell of a breakthrough. You could have a new person on your mind. Ooh, you're obsessed with this person. What else? What's the mutual energy here? Mutual. Mutual energy. Love. Okay, so you got a resting bitch face person that likes to have things balanced. Are they going to fight for this? Why the Knight of Swords reversed? Why the Knight of Swords reversed? Oh, I'm going to dump the whole thing here. I feel like they think there's twisted truths here. Mm -hmm. I don't see them budging. Are you? You want to break through. You're, you're obsessed, but you also have your doubts. There is mutual love here. Has this been on and off and on and off and on and off? And that's why this person's holding back and they're kind of irritated because this connection goes on, off, on, off. This can be an apology. Keep in mind, roles can be reversed. You can be the irritated person going, come to me, you jackass. Forward movement. They're going to let this go, so it's going to have to be you going to them if you want to keep them. One more for that 10. Mm -hmm. There needs to be two people putting work into it. It can't just be you. So right now, you're really thinking about it. Really thinking about it. I don't think there's any communication right now. There needs to... Be, this is intimacy. This was one hell of a connection. This was the person that looked looked at you with adoring eyes. There needs to be more work put into it, and it could move forward. There's a lot of passion here. This could move forward in a very nice way, but somebody's got a budge, and it's going to have to be you. I hate to say it. Temperance can be Sagittarius, but this is also going... This is two very different people that need to learn how to balance better together. It's having some patience where the other person does not have the patience. So you are really thinking about it. Do I put more work into this? Or do they need to put more work in? There is going to be a breakthrough. I do see somebody budging. They might just have stubborn energy for now and eventually they'll come around. They are thinking about you. They do care about you. Aw, come on. There's an offer. I do see that this could be a reconciliation. This is two people that care about each other very much. It's just like everyday life, but this person's stubborn as hell. My God. It's like there's such a tight ass that you could stick a lump of coal up their ass and have a diamond in a day. They need to budge. This is a very intimate relationship. Yes, it could have been very on and off. I'm not saying there was player shit going on here. There could have been, but there's love. There's love. You still are, you're still thinking about them. You're still fantasizing about them. That's what the hell we have here. You can argue it if you want, but that's what's here. Mr. or Ms. Resting Bitch Face is just stubbornly saying, you come to me or no deal. So, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, they are thinking about, you both are thinking of each other. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Virgo, Capricorn. Yep, all signs. That's quite the love story. 
Not exactly Rhett Butler. All right, let's get one. Shit happens. Let's see if we can get a little more insights. All right, this one here. Eat shit and you will shit shit. Look before leaping. Really? Eat shit and you will shit shit. Mm-hmm, look before leaping. I don't know how the hell that goes together, but okay. Let's grab one more. Oh, it's the Shittlemeister. <laughs> if it smells like shit, it's shit. Choices. <laughs> oh, my God. Yes, shit smells like shit. Bullshit smells like bullshit. One from the Oracle universe. Please source. I'm feeling this one here. Take the blindfold off. Okay, well, obviously you're missing something. And give it some time. Yeah, I don't know why this person's got such a big hair up their ass. Or lump of coal, whatever it may be. All right, I'm going to go Pisces. Elemental quickies. Killing with an Aries Leo Sag. That was quick. What do we have? The Queen of Wands. He or she got it going on. Digging you. Three of Wands. Ooh. They're making plans. Could be to come see you, spend time with you. It's going to be a little bit of a wait, but this does look like it can move forward with the Wheel of Fortune. Positive. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. One more shuffle. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So, uh, the sneakery, the fuckery card. Upright, screwed around. No, nope, didn't screw around. Holding back their emotions. This is somebody that is friend zoning you. They don't have interest, justice, and they feel justified saying that. So they're being truthful. They just aren't interested. Not right now. Heavy on the Libra. Okay, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. King of Swords, Reaper. Oh boy. This person's ticked off. Five of Pentacles. Oof. They think you should be the one to say that you were wrong. And then we have Ace of Pentacles, and I don't see that they're moving your direction anytime soon. You get the Two of Swords. Major stalemate here. That person feels very justified in saying, fuck you. Mm. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. That's some stubborn ass bullshit, too. All right, six of wands, stroke my ego. Why are we stroking this person's ego? <sighs> Two of swords. This is going to wrap into your reading. Hangman reverse, trust issues, and breakup. Could have been a third-party situation. Interesting. All right, clean deck. Oh, I'm making a mess. Oh, balance. All right. Let's see what we have. Pisces. Person most on their mind or in their energetic field is feeling sorry for themselves. They get blinders on, they're not paying attention to nothing. What else? You come to me. That's what I'm feeling here. Mm -hmm. They might be missing something. They might miss an opportunity if they think you should be coming to your you know. Oh. Mm -mm. This person is hurting. They are upset. This is heartbreak. Also could have been schmoozing bullshit too. One more for this one. Honest upright. No, they're full of shit. Okay, did they step out? There's something about this person that's bullshit -y. Can be a Capricorn. I'm feeling like they, the, the type of person that tells you whatever whatever you want. Yes, no, I agree. Yeah, mm hmm that's what it is. Oh, you're full of shit. All right, how does Pisces view this? Tia. You're like, I don't trust you, you immature little fucker. Seriously, one more. You don't even want to talk to them. Stay away from me, devil. You lying mofo. I don't trust your ass. I don't want to be with you. Okay, what is new for Pisces? New, 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 new. <coughs> My gosh. Okay. You don't want to have... 
anything to do with them. Okay, so we wrapped that story up. What is new? New for Pisces. New energy. <laughs> you are pissed off. <laughs> There's the stalemate. You're like, I am not coming your direction. There's something that you are missing, though. But you still do not trust that person. That is like major, no, do not trust that person. It's like, I don't need to think about this shit anymore. What's new? You're not, okay, <laughs> shit. Okay, you're, you're still sticking to this story, and you're, it's fresh. It has to be fresh, because right now we're not getting much new. No. No new offer, no new nothing. I'm moving on, I'm moving forward. This is all about timing, and this is what you feel is right. You want a connection where somebody's not going to hold back, and this is just not the right one for you. It's not the right time. Can be an Aries Leo Sag coming your way, but it's going to be a little bit of time, and you'll have to make a choice to go that direction. So you're going to need to heal a little more. Anything else? Heal. Yep. Your new chapter is coming, but you need to spend some time healing first. Wow. That person's a real dick. Bitch. Take your pick. I'll drop my... No, you're not dropping toxic nothing. You're feeling sorry for yourself. No, that's a schmoozer. We don't like schmoozers. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Manipulating jackass. You don't want to... You figured them out quite well. Okay, Capricorn... Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sag, that magician, misusing their power, like emotionally misusing their power, very potent in, in the way that, you know, convincing and you were almost trying to fool yourself by believing them because you wanted to try to make it work and you finally said, no, all right. Shit happens. One for you. Discover the meaning of shit. It's a quest, all right. One turd shuts down the water park. Caution. All right, let's get out the universe deck. Source. Yes, no, maybe so. We have for Pisces. In the affirmative. Bottom of the deck, we have never say never. Interesting. Okay, that was quite the story. Thank you so very, very much for watching. Many blessings, and we will see you next time.